Nej, 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 nej. Hej, Lenzi! Hej, Lenzi! Shoot! Can you hold my phone, Nana? I gotta put my mask. As we make our way up the Niagara River, look to port or the left side Whoa. of the boat where we will pass the American Falls. Look at that. It can best be described as the American side of Niagara Falls, Be. which in comparison Obama is a smaller waterfall that lies far to the left of the Horseshoe Falls so and is located between Prospect Point and Luna Island. According to scientific study and historical research, it has been concluded that the American Falls will eventually transform into a succession of descending rapids due to natural forces of erosion. The high flow rate of water causes the fall of large sections of bedrock from the American Falls, which is composed of soft shale and limestone. Though the height of the American Falls is higher than the Canadian counterpart, no daredevil ever preferred to go over the American Falls. All stunts were performed from the Canadian Horseshoe Falls, which is more popular with its immense water flow rate and shape. The height of the American Falls stands at 180 feet or 56 meters high. Its crestline, 1,075 feet or 328 meters wide. Its water flow, 75,000 gallons or 8,800 liters per second. And a recent notable rockfall. In 1954, a large section broke off and fell near the end of Prospect Point. Next is Bridal Veil Falls. The smallest among the three waterfalls, it is located on the American side, just to the right of the American Falls, separated by Luna Island. Goat Island is much larger and separates the American and Bridal Veil Falls from the Canadian Horseshoe Falls. The height of Bridal Veil Falls is 181 feet or 55 meters and remains the smallest waterfall compared to its two counterparts. Okay, I'm going to go to the selfie. 